Alrighty, okay. So, um, hello everybody out there in the world of, uh, the world. So basically, I haven't made a normal stay-at-home vlog in quite a while. Throughout the summer, we've just been kind of traveling, whether it's been going to San Antonio, to Vegas, or going out on little adventures like fishing or whatever, but I haven't really made kind of a stay-at-home vlog. I think I already said that. Today's just gonna be that. Hey, Dad, I'm gonna be shooting, so I'm not talking to myself, okay? I'm not weird. It's not that I think the normal life is just boring, it's just that I had, you know, more fun adventures, i.e. going on trips. So, I mean, it's it's just normal. It's normal stuff, like sweeping. And running. This treadmill's so scary. It's so old. I'm so tired. It's okay. However, Darren did go fishing yesterday. He went on an airboat, and uh, he caught a lot of fish. So he's in the kitchen right now. And so we're about to have the fish fry. 20 minutes of jump rope, done. <laughs> But yeah, you guys gotta tell me how you like these videos. Who knows, like maybe you guys really like them and I'm just like overthink. <laughs> Do I look like Pete Wentz from Fallout Boy 2007 Pete Wentz? <laughs> but uh, yeah, let me, let me know what you guys think. And I also wish I could tell you how great this pool feels right now. <sighs> well, it feels great, I just told you, but I wish you could feel it, you know? It's... All right, Darren, break it down for us. What are you cooking? I'm making fish. Uh, I went fishing the other day on an airboat. We caught 20 trout, three redfish, two black drum, and right now this is trout and black drum. The redfish were too small to keep, but we're making it work out here. Notice how he didn't say the seasonings. It's top secret. Darren makes some good fish. All right, Darren, what's what's your favorite memory of me? Of you? I kind of remember it, but I kind of don't. I'm scared because I don't know what I, it's going to be. I feel like it's going to be so embarrassing. It's not embarrassing. I had quit baseball because I hated the coach. And then Jared ended up quitting baseball so he could do theater. And I was like, there's no way in hell Jared can do theater. You have, like, if you didn't know Jared before theater, he was so quiet. He didn't talk to that many people. He did, but he was just real shy. His voice was real cracky. And he was an outgoing person. And so I remember I went to go watch his show. I can't really remember what show it was. And I was like, man, Jared is going to straight up embarrass himself. Yeah, I'm thinking this in my head. You know? as, as sad as it sounds, because like I knew Jared and I was like, man, there's just no way he could do it. And so he went on that stage and he freaking killed it. And honestly, I think I cried. I'm pretty sure I did cry because I was like, what? it was just a beautiful moment. And I was like, wow, I didn't, I couldn't believe that you could do something like that, Jared. That got, that got deep real fast. Oh, that's cool, man. Hey, bring it I in. Love you. Love you, Jared. Hey. For the bros, for the bros. This is Darian's memory of Arabella. We went to Universal Studios and she had been eating candy and like Slurpees all morning, like a nasty. And my parents specifically told her to stop eating this stuff and she wouldn't stop eating it. And we're like walking into Universal Studios, like as soon as you pass that thing, the, the little bar where you pass it and it flips back, she passes it and literally throws up pink ooze everywhere. Yeah, it was it was literally like rainbow colored. You know how like when you look under the school desk and you see different colors of gum? It looked like that, but combined. My favorite ones of him were whatever I would go uh, watch him play baseball. Whenever Darian runs, he kind of looks like like a like a horse. I look like a gazelle. Yeah, he looks like a gazelle whenever. But he I can runs. run freaking fast. Yeah, Don't Darian, get it twisted. Darian can run fast. I would be watching there like at the fence, and I'd be like, man. I want to be like Darian one day <laughs> with playing baseball. Darian's baseball stance is like picture perfect. I can I can give it to him. Yeah, give, yeah, give, give him the stance, Darian. Give him start here. Okay. Feet here. A little bend in the legs. Not too much though. That's the stance for every sport. Bat on shoulder. Knuckles lined up like this. Get your bat right here. Pick it up. Lean back. This is it right here. Look at that, look at that. I remember like uh, dad would take pictures of me whenever I would do my stance. I'd be like, man, like I just look like, well, I just look so funny. <laughs> That's a good memory, all, all your baseball games. That's good, Darren. How about y'all say grace? How about that one? God, me, let's eat. Darren, the food was Darren, amazing. This fish, guys. You're welcome. So Darian invited me to go out with them, so I'm gonna go out with them, but I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I'm gonna change real fast. I need to get my towel, so I need to do that trick. All right, you ready? Here you go. Well, that's more like it. <laughs> I do have an unboxing thing. I know I don't do unboxing things too often, but this is pretty interesting. At least interesting to me. This is a ball head. What it is, is I'll... Well, I can't really show you. So this is a ball head, right? It goes 
it goes on top of the tripod so that way you can move it around however you like and all that. So over here, this is a new tripod that I got. I wanted it because it's a monopod, but it has tripod feet. So if I wanted to get like a standing shot, then what I could do is I can do this and that can go up and then it can stand up to like my height. Thing is, is that I didn't have a ball head on here. The Vegas trip was kind of hard to shoot because basically it was just taking too much time to switch from this tripod to that tripod. And so what this allows me to do, <laughs> this thing's like not coming out. And so yeah, here's the ball head, right? Here it is. So basically what I can do now, and so I got it, so that goes on here. That screws on. I can take this release plate off because I already have one. Say I need to switch from that to this, get it real fast, and then I can put it on here, and now I have a standing one. And so now I can stand it up wherever I like. Now I can have like a standing shot whenever I want. That's my my super duper unofficial unboxing video. Brought it back. <laughs> I hope you guys are doing awesome. Thank you to all the new subscribers who subscribe to my channel. It really means a lot to me. Yeah, so that's going to be it. Uh, have a dream, believe in that dream, and never give up. I'll see you guys. See, the only thing is I don't know how to turn the standing thing over, but I guess, I guess I'll just put it all the way down. <laughs> Adios.